Hey guys, so today I'm going to be dyeing my bangs purple. The head I'm going to be using is Arctic Fox Purple Rain. I'm going to be using a very small amount of this dye. I'm going to mix it up with conditioner and then I'm going to apply it straight over the top of my faded yellow hair. So my original plan was I was going to tone my roots with Arctic Fox Periwinkle. Now I dyed my hair last time with the Periwinkle hair dye and I absolutely love how it fades to the beautiful silvery blonde colour. So instead of dyeing my hair periwinkle, what I'm planning to do is completely cover my hair with a silver shampoo to bring it back to that nice silvery blonde colour. But the thing is, I love having blonde hair. It's just so nice to have blonde hair. So until I get my hands on the Schwarzkopf silver shampoo, I am going to be dyeing my bangs a brand new colour and I decided to go purple. So when that fades out, it will kind of go a silvery colour and then I can go any colour I like on top of that. <laughs> so as you can see, when I washed my hair for the first few times after dyeing it yellow, the yellow dye did actually seep on to the rest of my blonde hair. So I'm going to just wait for this to fade out and I know once I put the silver shampoo on the blonde, it will help neutralise the yellow and orangey tones so it should help get rid of this. So I'm going to dye my bangs and I'm also going to cut them again so we have some micro baby bangs. So I'm going to be diluting the hair dye with the Tresemme conditioner. I don't need a lot because I'm only going to dye the bangs so I only need a tiny tiny, tiny bit. So about this amount and now purple rain. Ooh. So it is a very dark hot purple. So my personal experience with the purple rain hair dye is it does fade to a really nice silver colour as well. It does take a long time for it to fade out, but if you're patient this also makes a really nice toner for blonde hair. The smallest, smallest amount mixed with a lot of conditioner, if you put it all over bleach blonde hair, it will also turn it silver. So I do want it to be kind of a darkish purple, but not too light that it washes out really quick. Mix it up. Now, because purple neutralizes orange and yellow, I'm going to make it a little bit darker than what I want because putting it over the yellow, it might dull down the color slightly. Just gonna add a tiny little bit more. It's so pigmented, you don't need a lot. Clip my hair back just to make sure we don't get any of the dye on there. Okay, let's get dyeing. Okay, so I can see the yellow coming through the purple dye, so I'm going to not dilute the dye and I'm just going to put it straight over the top of this because if I rinse this out, it's going to be kind of patchy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put more of the purple rain and I'm just going to put it straight over the top because I probably diluted it a little bit too much. Okay, so I ended up putting the purple rain hair dye straight from the bottle onto my bangs. You can still see the yellow dye coming through the purple. So I put the dye on concentrated without diluting it and it's covered the yellow a lot better. Whew, so 
so I just got out the shower and I rinsed out all the dye and I'm really happy with the colour actually. It's a lot nicer than I thought it was going to turn out. I thought it was going to be like a mushy, muddy sort of colour but it's really nice. I'm not too sure how to describe the colour. It's not the same as what the purple rain would be if I was to apply it onto blonde hair. It's definitely kind of a little bit more like a musky purple if that makes sense. I was trying so hard not to cross the dye over to the blonde hair otherwise it would have just ended up bleeding and ruining all the blonde hair that I have. So the next part is I'm going to let this dry a little bit and then I'm going to get my hair clippers and I'm going to give it a little cut. Wow, it's definitely a lot different than what I expected. The colour looks a lot more kind of brownie red on the camera, but in real life it is more of a dark purple. <laughs> it's like the same colour as my curtain. <laughs> I, I really like it. I think once it's been cut, it, it will look better. So I'm going to cut my bangs using my hair clippers. One of you guys recommended that I try doing it with the clippers. It's a lot quicker and easier to get straight. Ooh, <laughs> it looks really nice. I like it. Cool. I look more gothic now rather than like all summery spring. 